Hello, my name is Eugene Weaver, and I am a product engineer with Schweitzer Engineering Labs, Fault Indicator and Sensor Division. Today I'm going to show you how easy it is to install the Underground Auto Ranger Faulted Circuit Indicator with Fiber Optic Display on an underground cable. This phase sensor can be used as a single phase sensor with local LED indication, or it can be used with a remote fiber lead that mounts to the side of a pad mount enclosure. This remote fiber optic display allows you to easily troubleshoot for faults in the field from outside the enclosure. So I'm here in the field with an underground auto ranger with fiber optic display and I'm going to show you how to install the faulted circuit indicator and the fiber optic display. So let me start by sitting this down and I'll show you how to install the display. First you'll have to punch a hole in the side of the enclosure. Then you'll disassemble the display insert it into the hole and then reassemble the display head. It's important that when you're doing this that your equipment is de-energized because you do have to reach inside of the enclosure to install it. So I'm going to now take the display lens and attach it to the faulted circuit indicator. It snaps right into place. Then I'll open the core slightly. I can now attach the fault indicator to my hot stick tool Now for this installation we're going to use two hot stick tools and I'll position the sensor up to the cable, reach around with my other tool and open the core, position it around the cable and then locking it into place back over the core. I can now remove the hot stick tool from the product and I've installed the product onto the cable. So now you've seen how easy it is to install the underground auto ranger with fiber optic display on an underground cable. You can use this sensor today to locate faults on your system and improve reliability on your circuits.